Good morning, guys. So, welcome. So, it's really early in the morning. And if you're seeing bruises on my face, I got into a fight. I'm about to tell y'all about it. I got punched in the face. Yeah, okay. I got my lip done yesterday. I got my little keep as well. It's so swollen. Oh my god, you guys. Like, it's like crazy. It's so sharp now, but it's so swollen. Like, it looks crazy. So today is going to be a cleaning slash work day. I have a little bit of work to do. I'm about to actually create my to-do list right now. And I'm going to make some coffee. You guys, I love coffee. Like, I can scream. I just love it. Like, y'all don't understand. I love coffee so much. Like, it's just it just makes my day. You see how cloudy it is outside? My day is literally about to be so sunny. Like, uh, it just, this looks crazy. But, um. My day is about to be so sunny. The sh is about to start shining outside because I have a sip of coffee. Um, yeah. I just finished doing my board. Look at that title. I'm so proud of myself. I just feel like sometimes stuff has to be cute for me to be inspired. So like, when I look at that, I feel like, oh my gosh, yes. Like, let's get the day started, you know? I definitely get inspired by like really cute things. Writing down my to-do list on the big board. I already have it on paper. Um, I'm gonna go to Home Goods later today because I need to get so much stuff. Like, I need to get like more pencil holders i have like so many pins that like i use for like my planners stuff like that so i need to like get little compartments to put it in because it's just i got so many books that i wrote in today so i'm really planning on doing that every day that was already my plan before but i had um kind of got off track when i went to new york so i'm gonna just finish doing the rest of my work today and then i'm probably gonna go to home gigs later so i'll see you guys Couple more decorated ones for the couch. Why? Why? Why do you need this many pillows? What do you mean why? Why do you need this many pillows? Okay, and then this is one that's gonna go on our bed. So we just need decorated ones for the couch. But I want white. I what don't do want any say? other color. I just got back. How pretty are these flowers, you guys? Like these flowers are so freaking pretty. I'm about to decorate a little bit. We're gonna see how it goes. I feel like they had a lot of stuff in that uh, home goods, but I don't know. I'm just not fulfilled the home goods in LA. Like the one I be going to in New York, they be having all the stuff. Okay, so we'll see what is given. And then I might have to like go back and get a couple more things depending. Okay, but the thing about it is that I'm not trying to get like just seasonal stuff. I'm not trying to get just seasonal stuff. I'm trying to get like stuff that can work all year round, you know? The only really seasonal thing I got was like a pumpkin. So like, look at this freaking pumpkin. Look. So I got like that pumpkin and I got, I got a lot of like hand soaps um, because um, we need hand soap and I got a lot of candles and I got me some socks because I love fuzzy socks I have to wear socks around the house Like if it's blazing then no, but I have to most likely wear socks But this is super cute and I need to like find somewhere cute to put it maybe like right there so This all of the most of this stuff is really just for like 
the living room and our bedroom. I did get this for the living room though, because it goes with the pumpkins and the flowers. So, but this is something that could always be used. So it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter what color it is. Um, I'm not a person that like goes uh, festive shopping all the time. So. decorate so I'm not sure how he's about to play his game but cuz I'm about to decorate over there anyway so I got some um, dishwash rags if you go over here I'll figure that out what are these um, kitchen towels that I needed earlier So this is one of my pumpkins. I also got some placemats. So right now, this is what my placemats look like. And I absolutely hate these. So I don't want these anymore. We're gonna change it to a little solid color, make it more natural and neutral. Um, we got another pumpkin. Look, oh you can't look, you'll see later. We got, It didn't crack. Uh, anyway, this is a pumpkin candle that I'm probably gonna light all year round because it smells like pumpkin and spices and stuff, and I think it'll go good with um with you know all the holiday seasons. So that just scared me. And then I got this white pumpkin. Mm, that smells good. These are gonna go in my bathroom. I, I love like pumpkin scents. Like I'm a person who really likes warm scents. Like warms are my thing. I would never do clean scents, fresh scents, or florals. Florals are like at the bottom, 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 bottom for me. So I'm really a person who likes a lot of warm scents. I love like cookie smells and baked sugar and like cinnabon and stuff like that anything with like cinnamon and it's just you know warm scent so i got two of those those are gonna go in the bathrooms and then i got this one this one is this the one yeah this is the one this one is a sea salt and lily now <laughs> i know i just said i hate fresh and floral scents, which this is a fresh and a floral scent mix. But what it mix, it doesn't smell like fresh and floral. It smells like a beach day. It smells like hairspray, kinda like, you know like that stuff you would spray in your hair? I guess, I don't, I don't know, but it smells really, really good. I don't know. But I know I just said that, I'm being a hypocrite. That one was good. And I always seem to like this brand, DW Home. I always seem to like that brand. Like, every time I buy candles, it's always that brand. And then I got this little, like, mason jar-ish, um, this um, soap dispenser. So I'm gonna use that for one of the bathrooms. These two are for the, um, what is it? The master bathroom, so I'm gonna use these. And I got this for the kitchen bath, the kitchen uh, sink. And I got a couple more things. So I got this for the salt and sugar. Salt, well not, sh not um, salt. I got that for the sugar because 
I didn't like the one I had before. And then I got one for flour. But I don't really cook like that, so I don't really use flour. But I just thought like it was just necessary to have two, you know. Another pumpkin. So this is the other one. We got really cute pumpkins. I love like abstract pumpkins like this. I love, love, love. And then we got one last pumpkin, which is a white pumpkin, of course. You know, you gotta tie in the white with everything. So I'm really excited about that. And we about to get to decorating. Get this cup I also got from Pottery Barn. It's a pumpkin cup. Now, I know it seems like I'm really going crazy with the pumpkins, but I'm really in the festive spirit, and I feel like this is a cup that I could use all year round. So, um, really, the only things I'll have to put away are the pumpkins. Everything else can really stay because I'm just a person that, like, I don't change my decorations, and I don't mind if it's like orange. In the winter i don't mind that like all you gotta do is just throw up a christmas tree like it still looks festive you know i also got these um crate and barrel uh pumpkin bread mix i got apple apple cinnamon quick bread this is apple cinnamon and then this is pumpkin spice quick bread and i actually tried uh crate and barrels um was it crate and barrels no it was william sonoma i tried something of their food before and it was so good like when i say good I mean good okay so I was shocked these are the pillows that I bought so I'm probably gonna put those up first I should probably put those up first because the pillows really shape the home you know like everything else is just accessories but the pillows shape the home these I don't know why we have these oh these used to go in my office but oh okay so we can get rid of those we can we can store these or maybe I'll just store the pillow and throw the actual blanket away. Let me just do that later. I'll just throw everything off. This can go. I'm over the glitter phase, y'all. Like, look at it. I'm over the glitter phase. I already have some gray right here. So my theme is gonna obviously be gray. So I'm gonna probably keep these ones. I'm not sure how I'm gonna decorate. to get the cut the, the stuff to move. show you all the way but look at that that looks so, wow it looks cozier in here it looks so much cozier
Good morning, you guys. So, I just woke up and I woke up pretty late today. Oh my God, you guys. Last night, I was trying this new iced coffee that I have. Um, I just bought the Starbucks iced coffee. And, cause I don't know, I think somebody told me to buy it. I had tried this one at first and it is not good. Like, I actually gotta throw this out. I don't like it. So I tried the vanilla iced coffee by Starbucks and oh my gosh, so freaking good. And I, all I do is use it with this creamer. This is my favorite creamer. It was so good. So I tried it last night and I literally like, <laughs> I had like a food gasm, literally. So I stayed up, I was up all night because of that damn coffee. I was so cranky and tired though. But anyway, let me show you guys what the house looks like because I know I couldn't show y'all last night because it was it got so dark. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. Oh my God, we gotta move that PS4 we're putting in that closet. But it looks just so much cozier. Don't mind those stuff over there, but it just looks much cozier. You know, got the orange peeking out over there and over there. And I don't know, I just really like, I gotta move that stuff too. But I just feel like the gray just looks cozier. Um, I wanna throw this blanket a little different. I love this color, like this rusty orange. I love it, like it's, it's the best color. But maybe that looks nice. Candles. Uh. <laughs> hey guys, so hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Look, it's dying. Every time I step outside, it dies. Now, goodbye for my channel, guys. <laughs> yeah, you guys, I was gonna say that I'm in, what is this Best Buy, buying a camera, but I'll just show you guys when I get back, cause there's too much going on right now. The camera's dying now. I'm actually buying a new camera, so I'll show y'all when I get back. Guys, so I'm back home. Finally got all of my stuff. Um, got the um, Sony ZV-1, I think. I really hope it's good because I don't really like Sony's. Um, I really like Canon's a lot. So I'm gonna just pray it's good, but I think regardless of what, it might be good because the one that I'm filming on right now is a Canon. And I'm gonna use that one for like my beauty stuff. And I wanna use this one for my vlogging. And then the other one is like the big camera. that I, I don't even use that camera anymore. I like invested so much money into that camera. That, that camera was like $5,000. Anyway, this is how it looks. Very slim. I like this because you can fit in um, your bag. This one that I have cannot fit in your bag. So this one is good. It looks like it doesn't come with a battery charger. It only comes with a cord. I haven't charged a camera like this in so long. Isn't that annoying, Mendeley? Like? What? It comes with this. It doesn't come with like the thing. So how do you charge it? Put it in here and put it in the wall. The whole camera? Yeah. Also, oh, you never take the thing out? Basically. That's annoying though. Yeah, because cool. what about, well, I guess, um, I guess what is this? you could still buy two batteries and just charge it in one. Charge it in both in the camera, but that's just annoying. I don't know, see? I already don't like it. <laughs> I hope I like it. So I'm about to start <gasps> vlogging. Let me see. It's really tiny. Ah, it's so small. Okay, so let's try it out. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I got a new camera, testing it out. Testing out the camera. I wonder how it looks. Let me know down below if you like how the quality looks. Actually, let's do comparison. So let's do comparison like this. 
Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, the picture definitely does look different. Um, I gotta charge it. Good morning. So, today is a Wednesday. The week is just flying past, okay? Like, I, it was just Monday. It was actually just Sunday. So, I'm about to make me a cup of coffee. I gotta get on a call in about like 10 minutes, probably less than that. So I'm gonna make me a cup of coffee. I'm not sure why I woke up today with a headache. Um, I don't know, it just feels, I just feel like I have a headache. I got a lot of packages to open to finish putting stuff around the house. I ordered a lot of stuff from Amazon and so, I'm gonna do that, but I have like a lot of work stuff to do today that I haven't really got done in the last few days. So, um, I need to fix my hair because I want to get on the call with a bonnet. <laughs> oh, today feels like it's going so fast. And I woke up pretty early today because I woke up at like six something, but then I went back to sleep and I woke up at nine or something like that. Early. I don't have my normal coffee creamer, so I'm using this one, which the Instacart person got for me because I guess they didn't have my one. I don't know, but supposedly they. Every time I order something from Instacart, they always have like something totally different. Like they they buy me something totally different, and it's really annoying. Like really fucking annoying. Every single time. Like when I tell y'all, it never fails. It never fails. I've been like. Basically, like, replanning my content and just trying to, like, reorganize myself because I have a problem with organization, clearly. So, so I'm trying to reorganize. Just have out, have planned out content. Sometimes I just use content and just, like, go off of, you know, what I feel and, like, what I want to do. But at this point, something's got to change. So... That's what I'm doing. So it's time to get on my meeting um, in like six minutes. But before I get on my meeting, I'm gonna send her, um, I'm gonna send her whew, basically the content that I am, we're having a meeting about. So this is a web developer and she's gonna, I'm looking to hire her to create a website for me. I'm really trying to really enjoy it and that's why I took like two to three weeks off to organize everything because I want to do this the best that I can you know like before I was just like kind of just going off of like what I feel and just doing what I love and you know when I first started it wasn't about the money like I wasn't making any money and I didn't know if that you can make money like it literally wasn't about the money it was just like what I wanted to do like I wanted to teach girls and as a kid I used to always say like I want to be a teacher but I didn't want to be a teacher in school it was weird so I guess now I'm kind of like a teacher like I taught a lot of girls how to do makeup and just a lot of other things I guess um you know I don't know but I just love what I do and I just can't wait for me to get everything just like perfect. It's never gonna be perfect, but I can't wait to get it to just where I see it and where I'm manifesting it, you know? It would really be an honor. It would uh, be super fun. I, I would really look forward to it, so. Sometimes I work with people just because of their vibe, you know what I'm saying? Like, even Absolutely. if it's not up to like, the standard or the quality i can teach them those things but you can't like you can't teach someone to have great energy so i really yeah. appreciate you guys for being so professional and you know i did find you guys organically you guys have great uh content you too. We'll talk to you soon. okay bye guys bye. Woo! i love when i get on great calls 
Hey guys, so I just finished answering some emails. I am literally exhausted only because I didn't eat today. It is 12.30, so I'm going to take this as... I didn't eat breakfast. I only drank my coffee, so I'm getting like drained a little bit. And I am basically blanking out. I don't have any knowledge of anything because I don't have any food. So I'm gonna make me something to eat, but I gotta make the bed first. crossed everything off my to-do list i'm so tired it's 5 30 and i'm really really tired like when i say tired i think it might be the chair though the chair i think it might be that chair making me tired i've been laying in that chair for about <laughs> three weeks now and i've just been extra tired and my back hurts and like Ooh, wah, wah. in the jungle Where is the song from? Lion King. No. Don't say Lion King just because it's a jungle. Where is it from? Tarzan. It's from Lion King. Hmm. I don't know. Sounds like a song in Lion King or Tarzan. The lion sleeps I never lion. watched The Lion King. Ever? What kind of childhood did you have? Did you know the lion? I had a traumatic childhood. That's what I had. Thank you very much. What that have Thank to you for reminding me. <laughs> what does that have to do? <laughs> what does that have to do with the Lion King? Though? I wasn't into that, and I still ain't. The hell, I want to watch the damn Lion King. It's it's, it's felt boring. I never watched um none of the Cinderella movies either. Yeah. I wasn't into those. I watched movies though, but I just wasn't into those movies. I don't know. I can't. I wasn't into like non-fictional stuff. I'm mean, I'm I'm a real bitch. Well, I guess it's called fictional, not non-fictional. It's fictional. But yeah, y'all. Um, I'm very tired. Like that chair. So I sit in that chair a lot now. And it's not like a good office chair, you know, like it's really uncomfortable and my back always hurts. And lately, what, like what, my what? knees have been hurting because of the chair, so. How did you miss? <sighs> oh, God, dude. Yeah. So, I'm really tired. But I think I'm gonna end this vlog here. And. No. Um. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end this vlog here. <laughs> y'all i'm empty okay i have nothing to give right now but thank you guys so much for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one bye <laughs> bye bye